Have you ever wondered how robots can learn to manipulate objects just by watching videos of humans manipulating different objects? Well, in this paper, we develop an approach for this problem that enables zero-shot robot manipulation from passive human videos. We want robots to be a generalist agent and solve a lot of different tasks in different environments. However, collecting a large amount of robot data at this scale is infeasible because it requires a lot of manual effort. On the other hand, videos of humans doing everyday activities are abundant on the internet. This also includes curated data sets like Ego4D and Epic Kitchens that contains hours and hours of human interaction. This data is abundant, but is unorganized. So we ask the question, how can watching these human videos help robots learn manipulation? Several prior works have attempted to answer this question. A line of work has looked at training image encoders from human videos that can be used for downstream robot learning through effective representations. Another line of work has looked at predicting interaction hotspots from human videos. However, these prior works do not consider any trajectory level behavioral insights from human videos. Observe the person on the left. Just by watching a video of the person, we can see that they're engaged in goal-directed behavior and we can infer how they're manipulating different objects in the scene. So observing the human does give us a lot of behavioral cues about how to act in the scene. So can we actually formalize these insights for robot manipulation? To do this, we note that hands are the primary tools with which humans interact with the world. Additionally, off-the-shelf hand detectors are becoming increasingly reliable at detecting the hand pose in different frames of a video. Based on this, we ask, can we extract useful information for robot manipulation by predicting future hand locations in human videos? This brings us to our approach, where for training, we have large data set of unpaired human videos, and we can extract the hand poses from each frame. We feed this to our model, human to robot H2R, that consists of a transformer and CVAE. During testing, given a scene image and optionally a goal image, the model outputs action trajectories that can be mapped to the robot's domain and executed on the robot with an inverse kinematics controller. For the experiments, we obtain hand poses in diverse human videos from the Epic Kitchens dataset with a two-second prediction horizon. The hand poses are extracted through the Fank Mokal hand detector. For evaluation, we consider several everyday objects with different plausible manipulations. All of these objects are unseen by definition since we are training the model only on human videos from the web. For the experiments, we have a Frank Amica panda arm and a camera in the scene to transform the model predictions to the end effector space and execute them in an open loop manner. Now let's look at some qualitative results for the unconditional model. Here the model gets just an initial image of the scene, and you can see that it predicts diverse plausible trajectories that in this case corresponds to opening and closing of the door. We can observe similar results across different types of objects. A door has a vertical hinge, a toaster has a horizontal hinge, drawers can be moved linearly, and a bowl of fruits can be moved around on the table in different directions. Now let's look at some results for the goal condition model. Here we feed in a goal image shown on the left along with an initial image of the scene. We can see that the different plausible manipulations correspond to bringing the objects to the desired goal locations. So in summary, we develop an approach to go from human videos that are unstructured to robot manipulations. We do this by developing a framework targeting course robot manipulation tasks. We hope our work provides understanding the limits of extracting action representations from passive human videos alone, such that they're useful for zero-shot robot manipulation. Thank you.